Love it's all Adam. protein because Myron Mixon is here. He's the most winningest man of barbecue for a reason. Dominique and I have been waiting patiently to really dig in because that sausage I tried, I've been dreaming about taking another Ooh, bite that's really since good. I tried it. It's amazing. Look at this. So what do we have here? The ribs are ready to go. They're ready to go. And the reason I got them standing on the edge like this, you got your rub and seasoning on the bottom. If I lay them down like that, they'll start getting liquid on them and it'll wash my rub off. Oh, oh. we don't want that. No. So you just take them. Sit it around while it's sitting there resting, soaking up the marinade, the injection, for about an hour, and then they're ready to go on the grill. And what did you inject it with, just to remind everyone at home? We got apple juice in here. I got some <gasps> of my hickory salt mixed in with it, also a little bit of sugar. Oh, my goodness. And Very is that simple. the finished product right there? That is the finished product right there. Oh All right, goodness. Dominique, if you want to try that, I'm okay. going to get some as well. Uh, how would you suggest how long do you put them in to cook them? Cook time, you're looking at about two and a half hours total. I will tell everybody that's watching. When that rib is stretched out like mm -hmm. this, that's thin. Right. Mm -hmm. You want to take them when you put it on the grill, tighten <gasps> it up. In other words, you go from this to that. And, and that's that, how you get that real good. Well, it holds it thick and it holds moisture Ooh. in. So you always want to do that. Oh my tighten God. it up like an accordion. I just, can I bite this? Yeah. I already had mm. one on my plate because I was waiting for this moment. Oh my goodness. It's really good. Well, tender. Wow. Tender. That is perfect flavor. It has like almost like a cherry wood kind of like. Flavor well, to it on the outside. All the food you're sampling right now came mm. from our restaurant in Alexandria, Myron Mixon Pitmaster Barbecue. Those sausage mm. you love were made in house for us. Myron, that sausage. I mm. love everything, but I would say that's my favorite besides these ribs. It's phenomenal. I What's can't your decide. Favorite? I'm going to go and get at it again, and then I'll decide See, my favorite. And I forgot <laughs> to say the chicken wings, too, because those were real that's good with that I'm vinegar saying. sauce. Best wings in the city. Mm. I second that. I gotta eat one. Of them. So, yeah. Yes, you do. So, Myron, you're telling me if you can't barbecue at home, you're not good with the smoker, they can go visit you in Alexandria. Correct. 220 North Lee Street. And you have something else coming up too, right? Capital Home Show? I'm doing the Home Show, the DC Home Show, Saturday. I'm there at lunchtime. Mm -hmm. It's over at the Dulles Expo Center. Dulles mm -hmm. Expo Center. You're gonna be there this weekend. People can come visit you. I'm doing the brisket uh, demo, so make sure you come by and but watch me because guess what I'm handing out afterward? What? Brisket. Brisket. Mm. And you know, Dominique, when the studio gets crowded in here with people just like yeah. kind of just like pretending to be busy. No, I'm just kidding. Everyone's working hard, but everybody's ready for a plate, right? Like that's a really good sign. I was looking at the couch and it's been filling up <laughs> over there. Baby. They get ready, they're staging up. People yeah. are getting their work done. And you know what? I think part of the fun of having really good chefs in is having the crew get to enjoy a meal, like it having is. fun and seeing everybody eating. Food brings people together, right? Yeah, and I have to say, before I started here with my Fox 5 family, I'm like, is it really good? Is the food really real? No, it's really good and it's really real. So you'll come back for fashion and food? <laughs> yes, fashion and food, count me in. <laughs> yes, and hashtag lie and lunch hour, weigh in on the conversation. Let me know your favorite thing to eat when you're eating barbecue. And coleslaw, that coleslaw yeah. and potato salad, you put bacon in the potato salad? That's loaded baked potato salad. Mm, that's why it tastes so good. Mm -hmm. Exactly right. Oh, my and we got our peach barbecue beans. It's got uh, peach pie filling in it. I've had that, and that's actually really good. That was what I was missing, the peach in it. You know it gets hard to do these segments because you just want to shove this food in your face? Yeah, and you, you have to try to talk. eat cute for TV. <laughs> yeah, sometimes <laughs> I forget the TV bite. Barbecue can, is only really good when you can get a little uh, messy with it. You, oh, you yeah. got to put your hands on it. Mm -hmm. You can't oh, yeah. sit there and travel with a fork and a mm -hmm. knife. you got to put your hands on it. you got to get real with it. So, Myron, you know, you've done a lot of different food shows. You've won a lot of competitions. You're taking things to the next level. Aside from being at the DC Home Show this weekend, anything else in the works we can look forward to? Well, we're looking right now. We have our restaurant here in Alexandria. We also opened one up in December last year in Hoboken, New Jersey. Always looking for a new location. Yeah, got to spread the barbecue love. Mm -hmm. That's what I do. I mean, every time you come in, you're a delight. We enjoy your company. And I love talking about those trending stories with you. <gasps> there we go. Did you? <laughs> I'm going to eat that. Oh, fake out. <laughs> Fine. Don't feed me on live TV. We'll go to commercial break. I'll, I'll be classy. I'll wait until we're off of me on the camera. Disney World.